And John, so, yeah. I have to be honest, though. I have to use the bathroom. Okay. So, should we stop the recording and start a new one? or? Hold on. You go to the bathroom. Christopher, we... going to the bathroom? What's going on? Is his stomach okay? You'll find out when we come back. There's no way I could go home. Finding out why you go. Where do you find your home in town? I am waiting here, waiting for Christopher to return. And there's nothing to be done. Yeah, viewers, I'm still waiting for Christopher to come back. Um, it's been like 10 minutes now. <laughs> I'm just singing at random. Uh, <laughs> hopefully, he just comes back within the next five minutes. Um, so, yeah. There's a bright golden haze on the meadow. There's a bright golden haze on the meadow. The corn is as high as an elephant's eye, and it looks like it's climbing glitter up to the sky. Oh, what a beautiful morning. Oh, what a beautiful day. I've got a beautiful feeling. Everything's going my way. I don't know. Yeah. There's nothing here. Nothing's happening still. I'm sorry, listeners. For my singing, but you know, nothing's going on so far. Uh, yeah. Jai sole al gange, jai sole al gange. Piu chiaro, piu chiaro svavila, piu chiaro svavila, piu chiaro, piu chiaro svavila. E ter giornis di la dell'alba che piange. Dell'alba che piange, dell'alba che piange, dell'alba che piange. Già il sole era al gange, già il sole era al gange, più chiaro, più chiaro sfavila, più chiaro sfavila, più chiaro, più chiaro sfavila. <laughs> ah, there once was a time where I lived alone. During this time, I waited for you, but you never came, and now I'm sad to say, I'm leaving you, because you left me, oh Christopher, why aren't you here? Why can't you stay and say hello? But since you're gone, and no, I say, <laughs> where did you go, my sorry friend? There once was a man who sat here Staring at a computer screen blankly. He looked at his microphone with a shine of red. And said, there's no one here to say or speak to or anything like that. I clearly am not a singer. But there's nothing else to do. It's been ten minutes, nearly twenty or fifteen, and I'm still sitting here for you. <laughs> I want my friend back, but since there's no sign of him, I'll just sit here and sing a sad or happy song depending on your view of life. There's no difference to say why we're all here today. But Bravado is really strong today. <laughs> you know, singing sounds different when you hear it in the recording versus when you actually sing it yourself. <laughs> oh, my goodness, where are you, Christopher? Where are you, Christopher? 
Where have you gone? The viewers and listeners are leaving this podcast as we speak, and there's no, there's no sight of them. I blame the government personally for all this mess that's been going on. I hope you're not trying to steal my money. I hope you know how things work out or how they don't work out. You know, when you're left alone with a microphone in front of your face, you start to do weird things. You start speaking in a different voice, maybe a different accent. And you start letting your mind go to places you don't want it to go. Such places that are dark and mysterious and insecure. Perhaps Christopher has unlocked my true potential. My potential as a person who no longer has a mind to mind. <laughs> but for real. Where the heck is my friend? I have no idea, and now all the listeners are just listening to me. All right, question for your listeners. What do you think is going on? Any questions that you have for us for our next podcast, let us know. Let us know what you think. Let us know whatever taxing questions that you want us to discuss. Perhaps we have something for you. Also, when you get the chance, please, please support us either by watching more of our podcasts or by supporting us. One dollar makes all the difference. (laughs) Oh, my goodness. Where are you, Christopher? Day 13 of Time Without Christopher. I've decided to live with the more people. They've entrusted me to be their queen. I told them that I was not a female, but... I just accepted the job anyway, because it would be fun to be a queen. So far, nothing has happened. They told me just to be the queen, sit there in the throne, and do nothing. I felt sad, because this is, ex- this is the exact same thing I'm doing with Christopher. Day 14. Finally, something to do. They told me to go outside, start the sun, and drop dead. I did the first part. I couldn't drop dead. It was really difficult. I did all my best, but nothing happened. Day 15. I decided to become an astronaut. Not sure why. I just looked up at the sky. Still, real- still realizing I was blind, I said, You know what? I want to go to space. So now, I'm going to be an astronaut. Day 16. I'm now in prison. I've been arrested for trying to step into a spacecraft. Since then, I can't see the light. Neither could I do it at any point. Oh, hey, what's this? Remnants of a friend? <laughs> Hello there, Christopher. <laughs> hey, sorry. My, my stomach feels better, but still, I feel like I could have been there longer. But anyways, <laughs> the show must go on. Yes, I mean, I've been sitting here for the past 20 minutes just trying Has to... Has it been 20? I'm I don't... sorry. I think, yes, it has been 20. Uh, I'm so, sorry. So, yeah, you missed out on me singing a few songs and then me just ranting about things I could have done. You, you missed out. Part you of missed, the podcast? Yes, it is. That's amazing. You, you missed out on a fun conversation I had with myself <laughs> or, or a fun series of dialogue that could have been fun. You'll have to listen to the podcast okay. and give me a, a cent by doing that. Yes, sir. <laughs> That is so funny.